Welcome to a new video. In this VW Tiguan, the multifunction steering will no longer works correctly. You can see what this coil spring has to do with it in the video. In this vehicle, it only affects the multifunction steering wheel. This means that if I press the volume down button here, the radio no longer becomes quieter. But the airbag system is still connected here. And if this is no longer triggered in the event of an accident, it doesn't exactly prolong the driver's life. That's why we're replacing the coil spring. Please bear the following in mind. Please always read the fault memory first. It is also very important that this work may only be carried out by personnel with airbag training. Nothing is stored in the fault memory. So we can start. Before we start with the work, you should look up the manufacturer's instructions. They contain all the relevant information and the first thing we should do is disconnect the battery. The airbags are usually secured from behind with clips. I have now wrapped a 5mm spike with adhesive tape so that I don't scratch the fittings. Before working on the metal, I ground it and then we can go behind it with a mirror and you can already see it. There's a predetermined breaking point here and that's where I pierce. The instructions describe exactly how to proceed. Let's try that out. Sometimes it's not that easy. Here you can see better where I tried to loosen the airbag. I went in here with my spike and when I tighten it now, these clamps come apart and ensure that the airbag comes towards us. That can sometimes get stuck. In the end, we managed it. The airbag is removed and now we can dismantle the steering wheel. It's best to do this in pairs, as one person has to hold the steering wheel and the other has to undo the screw. There was a screw at the bottom here. There are two clips at the top. Once you have unhooked the cables at the back, you can pull everything out towards the front. It is important that you do not twist the component. A safety catch is fitted to the new coil spring. This is in the straight position. Take care of your apprentices too. Please do not twist it. We have just removed the coil spring. You can't hear anything, but it's definitely broken. We have another old spring here and you can really hear the defect. It cracks loudly during rotation. So it makes a clear noise and you can tell that the conductor track in the housing is broken. With this one, the horn was permanently on. Unfavorable for the driver. As I am curious, we have now completely dismantled the broken part and here you can clearly see the damage. The conductor track is torn. Here is a strain relief that is supposed to hold the cable on the connection. It has torn away from this. So damage caused by mechanical impact. We got it from another workshop. They replaced the part and made it available to us. We can save ourselves the trip to quality management this time, because our coil springs are exclusively original goods. This is very important to us because safety is crucial. The airbag is involved and we don't compromise on that. In any case, we have always ensured perfect fit and function. Installation is self-explanatory. Simply reassemble everything in reverse order. It is only important that you leave this red cap on until you reinstall the steering wheel. This ensures that the coil spring cannot twist and is not damaged. I have now looked at the fault memory again. There is nothing in there except for the steering angle sensor. We have to initialize it again, depending on the manufacturer's specifications. In this case, we simply do this during a test drive. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. 
If you have any questions or suggestions, write us a comment and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you next time.